Alrighty, let's get this started. Okay, what server to pick? Stream Hardcore. Hell yeah, let's go to Stream Hardcore. Totally not going to die multiple times. Totally not at all. Ah, uh, yes. Great connecting. Most perfect thing ever. Uh, this is so much entertainment right here. Just so much entertainment. Oh, hi, JBs. No. No, please, game, please. Please. <laughs> please don't crash. I'm good. How about you? No. Please. Ah, good. Also, if you're wondering who this little guy right here is, oh shit, that is SCP-5000, my new little robot baby thing, and I love him. Okay, black screen, that's perfect. I have entered the darkness, the darkness of my soul. I have entered it. Oh, oh, okay. Well, what? Where did it go? <laughs> where did a voice check go? I'm here to be nice as it's Christmas Eve. <laughs> you want to get on Santa's uh, good list, not the naughty one. Oh, this. We're not going to talk about that. We're not going to talk about that. Yes, let's let's go hardcore. Only hardcore. Oh, I'm already on good list. I already forgot any arts. <laughs> yes. So, as you can tell, we're, we're, I'm rewarded with great entertainment with connecting. Yes. I think I messed up earlier today. Want to know what I did? Uh, sure. Oh. Uh. Well, am I in? I see voice chat. Yay, I'm in, but I can't, I don't see anything. Shh. 
schisms. Okay, there we go. Is it stopped lagging? Oh, nope, they died. As soon as it stopped lagging, they died. Session was in row. I was for a call and I sing Santa Claus is coming to get some kids. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no, are they so nice in Christmas spirit? Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, totally. Yeah, that's that's totally nice. There's, there's so much good entertainment right here. Yes. Hello, 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 hello. Can you hear me? Okay. Oh, wait, what the hell happened? Hello. Okay. I guess it's time to murder some people. I have no idea where the hell to go. Oh gosh, like is real. I have no idea what happened. Ever since the Christmas update, it just lagged the shit. I like it. Hello. Can I kill you? No. Fuck.
All right, I'm just gonna go inside here and most likely end up dead. That's fine. Use the elevator. Thank you. I have no one idea what the hell happened and why it crashed. It just did. And oh, oh, doors are gone. Doors went bye bye. Don't oh, you some motherfuckers? Thank you. <laughs> It really said self destruct. <laughs> oh no. Hello. Housekeeping. I'm totally housekeeping. You can come out. I won't murder you. Oh, 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 I'm gonna get out of this room. You know, I'm out of there. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Why is everything dark? No. I'm totally housekeeping. I won't commit arson or kill you. Conference room 9B. Okay, that's locked. That's locked. Okay, then where the fuck am I supposed to go? Oh, there's sideways doors. Like I could see the fucking sideways doors. Oh, hello. Oh, shit. Oh, he's a good doggo. This is a good doggo. <laughs> Instead of you being scared of the game. Hush. Hush, JBs. What's up? Fuck. Doggo turned on me. I'm not happy about the doggo. That was a bad doggo. <laughs> He's still outside. <laughs> Run, Chaos and Sergi, run! He died from a dog disappointment. <laughs> <laughs> run, Chaos and Sergi. Oh no, he's done. Wait, what? Excuse me? Excuse me? That call bullshit on how you escaped there, buddy. <sighs> Wait, there's only two people left. One is still outside just AFK, while there's just one running for its life. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. Ah, uh, yes, eyes through the doggo. Oh, nope, he's dead. Oh, wait, nope, the guy outside's dead. Okay, so it's just the guy running. <laughs> Somehow they made it out alive or well, almost. They just need to find the exit and they're free. Oh well it's not from murder, I guess. <laughs> Four SCPs versus one person who will survive. Oh, Oh, now they fucked up. As I have a gun. Wait, hold up. I have a gun and a grenade. But grenade's more important. Because it does most damage. I can blow shit up. 
Time to blow some shit up. When? You're going to come in? I had to. I had to. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I at least took one of them with me. <laughs> I just would be sick of me talking about the arson 24 7 as a And the fact that I have no answers for the lighter. <laughs> oh. The, the doggos are killing, killing them. Self destruct. <laughs> Yep, there's the doggo. Oh, the doggo go over there. Oh, that's two doggos. <laughs> he blew up the door. <laughs> would, I, would I get banned from Twitch if I sing your new boyfriend, which I'm going to do a cover on? I don't even know what that song is, but maybe. I just really want to scream on live. Your new boyfriend, an asshole. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Ah, Merry Christmas, Lilith. Technically, it's Christmas tomorrow, but yeah, Merry Christmas. <laughs> Though I am going to be doing something special, which is, uh, since every time I do an, an SCP like live stream, I read SCPs. Okay, this person's dead. Anyway. Uh, I'm gonna. Doctor Bright died. I don't care what time she self destructs. Gonna laugh too much for that excess. <laughs> but anyway, um, I am gonna read two Christmas SCPs. Yay! That only happens at certain times. That that is if I keep if I stop dying. <laughs> Last last death was me being stupid. Uh, not particularly. I don't think so, Jay. I don't think so. <laughs> I never get fought. <laughs> In a video game, of course. <laughs> <laughs> what is there, a Christmas tree SCP? You know, that would be funny, but I don't think there is. I only picked two that I know exist, which is a Snowman SCP and the Yule Man SCP. Trees are pot. You know, I'm actually going to look that up since I'm dead. I got nothing to do but watch people. I'm going to look to see if there actually is a Christmas tree SCP.
Well, what a fucking surprise, Lilith. There is one. <laughs> I'm not gonna read it, but still, there really is one. Oh my gosh, there are multiple at Christmas tree SCPs. Why? There's, oh wait, no, there's only two. There's two Christmas tree SCPs. My sister's tree is so fine. <laughs> I don't think you kind of remember that. <laughs> of course there is. <laughs> Go, Duggo! Kill all of them! Kill all the- kill all the humans! Go, Duggo! I'm not surprised at this point. <laughs> no, Duggo! Well, time to kill last SCP. Alright, even though this is not explosive for us, hi, dicks! Are any of us really surprised? <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> Can't kill pressure. <laughs> Everything's self destruct. <laughs> Don't worry, I won't do self destruct this time. And there we go. <laughs> See, I didn't die. Cute pieces of shit. Uh, not you guys. Tell me. Aww. I wanted to kill some people. Oh my god. Why, why am I not allowed to murder? Murder is fun. Right? Right, SCP-5000? Murder is fun. Don't say anything you think murder is fun. See? SCP-5000 right here agrees. Murder is extremely fun. <laughs> oh. I'm also totally safe if you were wondering. <laughs> totally. Oh, I'm a facility guard. Well, time to murder. I was gonna do all these things, but then the weather decided, F you, I'm gonna start raining. <laughs> Open the door. Thank you. Oh, hello. Okay, so don't go that way. Go this way. Snowed a lot for me. Lucky. I wanted snow. I, then I can throw stuff at people. Oh, oh no, the darkness. Oh no, I don't like the dark. No, no, no. Turn the light on. Do I have a flashlight? Sweet Jesus. No, I do not have a flashlight. Jesus, I can't even see. Oh. I did something. I don't know what I did, but I did something. Oh, the lights are back on. I fix lights. I am a good not imposter. Totally not an imposter. I am good. <laughs> oh 
Oh my, I'm not going to say that, but okay. <laughs> I just need to run off, find some D-class, and, and murder them. Because that's what we do at the Foundation. I mean, it's pretty much accurate. Uh, no, I don't think we can open that. No, we cannot. Okay, where are some D-boys that I can murder? I want to murder some D-boys. Okay, not in there. Where the fuck do I go? Why is the foundation so much of a maze? <laughs> oh no. Oh no, oh no, oh. What's that say? Intercom board. And of course, I get access denied. And can't even freaking see where the fuck I'm going. Oh. Hello. Who the fuck are you? You weren't there before. Um. Oh. Wait, what item did I get? Well, the, 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 excuse you. Excuse you. Okay, anyways, I want to go as I'm so powerful being called. <laughs> oh, thank you. And Merry Christmas to you, too. Hey, apparently I met a, a freaking teleporting Christmas tree. Don't know how, but I did it. So I would love to know where the hell I'm going. Oh, <laughs> the tree gave you a gift and gift and didn't murder you. What what does that say? If you can tame myself, yes, this is where I need to go. You fuckers. Yes, let me the fuck inside. Thank you. Now I got my gun. Not even sure if I'm even going near anyone that I can kill. Oh, hello. No, 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 how the fuck do they get guns? Bullshit. Wait, where the hell are the SCPs? There's no SCPs. What the fuck? Okay. Weird. Why well, there's no SCPs, but time to read one. So I think I hit the mark. Yeah, I hit the mark. All right, SCP-4230. Object-classed Euclid. Containment procedures. Barbed metal fencing is to be constructed in a 6-meter circular for formation around SCP-4230-1's activation point. They ran away to celebrate Christmas. <laughs> As SCP-4230 is immobile and cannot be relocated without restraining Severe damage. How the fuck did SPs win when none of them are alive? Okay. Instances of SCP-4230-A outside of, of SCP-4230's range are to be melted down 
and or destroyed within 72 hours. Instances of SCP-4230-A within SCP-4230's radius uh, are to be destroyed using long-range objects or weapons within the same time span. Foundation medical researchers are currently developing a cure for SCP-4230-1. In the event that more than 20 instances of SCP-4230-B are present in one area, Site-2 is to enter lockdown mode immediately preceding the dispatch of MTF Delta-14, aka Winter Wonderland. Description. SCP-4230 is a crudely constructed snowman measuring 1.5 meters in height and consists of packed snow and traces of various natural debris such as dead leaves and... Oh, yes. Anyway, that much is dead, uh, dead leaves, much mulch and soil. SCP-4230 does not appear to deteriorate or melt unlike ordinary snowmen when human and animal organisms enter within a 4 meter radius of SCP-4230's novice activity occurs following SCP-4230's activation. What the fuck do I get out of here? Where the fuck did I go without even looking? But anyway. Uh, SCP-4230-1 is an anomalous event capable of reconstructing the skeletal system alongside controlling organ and cell functions to distort the host body to appear as a featureless snowman. SCP-4230-1 has been noted to be extremely painful to the subject and in all recorded instances lasts around 7 to 8 days. In humans, in, in 13 to 15 days, in uh, large animals. Oh, I can't go that way. Fuck you then. Can't use that either. What a fucker. Anyway, SCP-4230-1 may take effect within 11 days following an interaction with scp 4230-1. Once an S SCP-4230-1 has completed the process of transforming the host body, these bodies are be designated as instances of SCP-4230-A. Ooh, can I take? Ooh, I want this. Fuck you. Give me it. I have I have nowhere where to fucking go. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I, I'm literally just trapped here, which is fine. This is this is fine. I can just I can kindly just run back and forth while reading. That's fine. Right. Instances of SCP-4230-8 have been shown to host white spherical eggs, and these eggs can hatch in SCP-4230-B instances with a span of 72 hours. Each SCP-4230-A Wait, what the fuck? Why did that door close? Weird. Anyway. Uh, it may produce up to 19 instances of 4230-B. Destroy instances of 4230-A along with the eggs they contain have been classified as, as an essential process to contain SCP-4230-B. SCP-4230-B instances are extremely hostile organisms and resemble a 0.6 meter tall snowman with bloodshed, a blood light eye similar to in design and identical in function to those of an insect. All SCP-4230-B instances possess a 0.2 meter wide hole indicated between the eyes, featuring teeth, which in all which in all observed instances point inward. All attempts to communicate with SCP-4230-B instances have been met with aggression. Upon being born, instances have been shown to reach adulthood with a span of 15 seconds. 
the exact lifespan of SCP-4230-B instance appears to be 24 hours. In all instances, seemed to melt away approximately one day after being born, regardless of the envir environments they were present in at the time. SCP-4230-B instances have been observed to be car carnivores and, in all recorded instances, hunt in packs. Instances of SCP-4230-B strongly dislike warm temperatures and will actively avoid areas with a temperature of 40 degrees Fahrenheit or above. Don't even know how much that is in Celsius. Don't ask, please. <laughs> Attempting to retaliate against an SCP-4230-B attack with snow or ice will result in data expunged. Discovery report. On January 12th, 2019, Robert and Michaela P. Anderson, residents of Grain Valley, Missouri, contacted the Grain Valley Police Department claiming that their son had been attacked by an instance of SCP-4230-B while playing outside in their house's front yard. When the police officers arrived at the scene, Foundation personnel were contacted after an officer was wounded by an instance of Mobile task forces arrived at the scene and safely contained an anomaly 15 minutes after receiving the call. Amnestics were administered to the officers present at the scene as well as the Anderson family. Hello. I don't know, I don't know how to kill. Anyway. Uh, 15 minutes after receiving the call. And uh, 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 yes. Following the administration of Next Six, a cover story was fabricated about Michael Anderson, nine year old son in the Anderson family, accidentally getting himself stuck in a pothole and officers having to rescue him. Incident report on January 1st, 24th, 2019. Uh, Agent Blank failed to, I mean, not Agent Blank, Agent Redacted failed. To terminate an instance of SCP-4230-A within a 72-hour lifespan, as proposed by senior researcher redacted, the following assault carried out by nine SCP-4230-B instances resulted in the death of 27 Foundation personnel. Agent redacted is promptly reprimanded for the incident. Footnotes. SCP-4230-1 can occur in plants, however, no anomalous transformations or effects have been witnessed. SCP-4230 appears to only be triggered, only be the only trigger capable of activating SCP-4230-1. And that's SCP-4230, the snowman. Uh, not sure if anyone's still here, but if anyone's still here, uh, what are your thoughts about it? <laughs> at, at first, I thought it was gonna be nice. It, it's it's not a nice SCP. It's very far from it. How the fuck do I kill? S zero nine six. Ah, hi, Dick. What's, oh, here's the fucking exit. Okay. Killer Snow, I'm not surprised. <laughs> uh, oh, Snowman. <laughs> Hello. It's an SCP, the only nice one is the Legos. <laughs> well, there's also the Tickle Monster. Why is it saying I can't activate the door? Hello. Would you like to see me? Come on. Just a little look. It's fine. 
<laughs> I wrote a story because I can't have any colored snowman in it. <laughs> Ah, motherfucker. Well then. I think I lost them. Or, oh wait. Um. Oh, now I have my activated power. Holy shit, I'm fast as fuck. I only remember her because the teacher took all of our stories and had some books made. Uh, books made, it was nice. Oh, what the fuck? We meet again. We meet again, tree. What you got for me? Huh? Tree. You have nothing. You have nothing. Fuck you, tree. The tree. Nope, I can't jump over the railing. Damn it. I was gonna jump down. It'll be fun. Oh. Well, that works. Jeez, why am I lagging? Hmm. There's none over here. Let's see, what about up here? No presses for that CP. <laughs> oh, up here? No. I'm not gonna try it. Can I go in here? Damn it. Oh, damn. I know there's like another side, isn't there? Okay, I need to go to gate B. That goes where most people are at. What the fuck? Okay, I just magically teleported. Probably the tree's fault. Tree, don't teleport me. I teleport when I want to teleport. Oh, this is in use. Okay. Yes, use this. Oh, what the fuck? Whoa. Okay. Ah, double moderation. Wait, am I stuck in this room? I am literally stuck in this room. I am stuck in this room. I am fucked. Well then, ain't that great? Right when I was gonna get some good content, no, I have to be stuck in their freaking room. Let me in. Damn it. Oh, I guess I. Motherfucker, you marker elevator, don't shut on my face. Yes, okay, okay, immediately shut. Oh, 
okay. With you, elevator. Hath been deleted, my lady. <laughs> Can I go in here? No, I cannot. Okay. Now it must be this way. Because there's. Because technically, you can literally walk to gate B, I believe, with through gate A. I have no idea. It's been a while. Nope. Oh, there's more people. Yay! That don't spawn where I'm at. Fuck. Why? All I want to do is some murder. Her. Please, can I just kill one person? One person, that's all I ask. Just one person. Oh, oh sweet Jesus, something exploded under there. And of course the door's not open. Fuck. Why? I I I'm I'm glad that I'm alive still. But I want to murder. I wanna murder. I wanna just stay here and do nothing. I want to kill things. Also, what the hell is going on with this elevator? <laughs> like, is, is there like someone invisible messing with the elevator? <laughs> oh, 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 hi. Open the door. Open it. Damn it. Where the fuck did he go? There's only one way to get out. I think. Oh, wait. Could you? I don't have to climb straight up. There's literally a path. There's a path. Where does this take? Oh no, it takes me straight up. Never mind. Oh hi, there you you went. I lost track of you because it's dark. Where the fuck you go? The fuck? Oh, no 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 no.
No. Kill. Kill, damn it. Won't you let me kill? Tickets. No, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Fuck. And I didn't kill anyone. Damn it. At least my suffering will bring content. Wait, what? Who is the last SCP? Oh no, the last SCP is a person who can't kill anyone. Oh no. <laughs> Wait, they could have opened the door. Why the fuck did they not open the door? I am upset now. I am very much upset. Yeah, I don't I don't see how the SCP is gonna win. Since there's an only SCP left can't kill anyone. <laughs> okay. I am gonna take one for the team. Gotta run, gotta run, gotta run. Fast, fast, fast. Gotta run fast. Gotta run fast. Right, is no one Gosh dang it, no one's coming for an elevator. Right when I was gonna blow all the smithereens. No one goes for the elevator. And there we go. <laughs> I probably didn't even kill anyone with that. That's fine. Looks like the kills are trying to get some moments together. Oh. Eh. I'm I'm probably not gonna join. Because I'm doing a double stream today. So I probably won't join. Where the fuck is everyone? I want to do some murder. Oh right. That one has CP that's a lot. Is is the only one I can't attack. Oh no. Oh no. Well then we can just I can just run around and shoot things. Shoot the ground or whatever. Since just waiting for timeout. As much as I would love to call out of work, I could really use the, the quiet day to get some things done. Uh that's understandable. Nobody can tell from SCP. <laughs> but yeah, a quiet day is all, is a nice thing to have. Yeah, I agree with all of this. Hope, hope you get everything done. Sharing is caver to faint. Uh, caring if the favor might be returned. Hell no. I will, I'll never share in this game.
Oh, I'm another SCP. Okay. Hit the instant kill enemies. The short cooldown interact recently did. Humans get an ally. Okay. Left click. Let's go. <laughs> hmm. Where are the D boys at? Oh. Oh, hello. I guess I'll follow the doggo. Who is better than one? With Jesus, sending hugs and encouragement. All. Hey, yeah, so you got it, Lola. Oh, I mean, not Lola. Dicks. <laughs> you got dicks. <laughs> Confused with who she first did. Oh, hello. Huh, so I can already escape. Well, that's a bad move on their part. Let's see, where to escape? Okay, nothing that way. No. Oh, sweet. What the fuck? Okay, I teleported. Wish it would stop teleporting me. So this way. I hate mazes so freaking much. I can never tell if I'm going the right fucking way or not. It, did I go this way? I'm confused. I can't tell if I'm going in circles or not. I hate mazes so freaking much. Wait. Just dang it. I thought this was gate B or gate A. Damn it. Waffles. I'm surprised I have yet, yet to find anyone up here. Usually the guards are up here. Uh, isn't it great to see me struggle to get out of this maze? So much freaking entertainment this way. So much entertainment. I'm watching me struggle. I have no idea what this... Another guard spawn room, okay. Obviously, I haven't been this way because of the doors. Okay. Oh, sweet Jesus, lag. No, please.
I guess I'll go forward, maybe? Oh, shelter. Evacuation shelter. Nope. Let's go this way. Did I just came back right where I came from. I just went straight back. I made a full-on circle. Motherfucker. I'm totally someone you should take a, a person to a corn maze to. I totally know which direction I need to go in. Totally. Totally don't struggle at all with mazes. All right. Get in. Hmm. Where the fuck's gate A or gate B? So, oh, hello, hello, Submatica. You've just joined me in the struggle of trying to get through this. And also, thank you for following. I freaking hate mazes, and I'm stuck in one. And I, 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 and I want free so I can murder. You free. Just let me go to gate A or gate B. A donut. Oh. What type of donut? Let me free. Let me free. I don't want to be in here fucking anymore. Please let me free. Kind of circling again. <laughs> Why? White with chocolate frosting. Oh, ah, hey, 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 hey. Who the f who's shooting me? Wait, how am I dying? What? There's. Oh, there you are. Grass over here. Piece of shit. Yes, over here. Fuck. Damn it. Well then, upon my death, I guess I'll read another SCP that's Christmas related. Because this game just loves doing it. Yeah, yeah, he's dead. <laughs> anyway, SCP-4666, Object Class Keter. Special Containment Procedures. Web traffic and law enforcement channels worldwide are to be monitored for evidence of SCP-4666 activity, and particularly for cases of stalking or reports of anomalous phenomena involving families with young children. Should a West Knock event be suspected to be in progress, the nearest containment task force is to be dispatched to attempt contain of SCP-4666. Standard P PDP, VII, humanoid first contact protocols apply. Media coverage of family deaths attributed to SCP-4666 is to be, be suppre uh, suppressed or falsified to make said deaths appear as non-anomalous. Home invasion, murders, forensic evidence, and SCP-4666-A instances collected from non-foundation agencies are to be confiscated and witness amnestic size. Um, what is the server? Um, it's one of the, where it says hardcore servers, like SCP hardcore something. I think it was like the first one.
description, SCP-4666 is currently believed to be a single, exceptionally long-lived humanoid entity of unknown origin. Survi survivors of West Nile events typically describe SCP-4666 as a very tall, elderly male of European descent. With an extremely emancipated appearance, the entity always appears completely naked, even when observed outdoors in freezing weather. Though the nature of an extent of this anomalous properties remain uncertain, SCP-4666 appears capable of instantaneous or near instantaneous travel at any location north of the 40 degree north latitude, and possibly any location on Earth. Um, maybe I might might read that after this. All right. SCP-4666 activity occurs exclusively with a period of 12 consecutive nights every year from the night of December 21st to 22nd to the end of to the night of January 1st to 2nd. This period is known as SCP-4666 active phase. During this phase in what turn Westlock events, SCP-4666 will appear at dwellings in one or multiple locations north of 40 degree north latitude. In all known Westlock events, these dwellings have shared the following characteristics. Isolated rural location, home to to a family with at least one child under the age of eight, and situated in an area with snow cover lasting throughout the duration of the event. West Night events consist of the following general progression. Nights 1 through 7. Children will report seeing SCP-4666 in the vicinity of the family's dwelling. The entity will typically be observed watching the dwelling from a distance, such as a form across a nearby field or from the edge of a neighboring forest. In some cases, children will report waking up the night to find SCP-4666 watching them sleep through a window. Nights 8 through 11, family members, including the parents, will report sounds of footsteps coming from the roof or the attic. An extreme unpleasant odor will also frequently be noted inside the dwelling. No cause for the phenomena will be found. As a result, parents will often begin to suspect that their family is being stalked or even that their dwelling might be haunted. Night 12. Over the course of the night, one or two scenarios will occur. The first and most common is that SCP-4666 will kill all members of the family save for one child say for one child under the age of eight whom will whom it will abduct sp4666 will inflict incapacitating injuries to family members while while they are sleeping one second yes. then herd them to a single room of the dwelling where they will proceed to kill them oh shit oh right now Anyway, right, proceed to kill. Uh, proceed to kill them in the view of the, each other. The method of killing for, varies with the event, and will typically be uh, preceded by some form of torture, which appears to serve a, a ritualistic purpose. In the second scenario, which has occurred in roughly 15% of known West Nile events, SCP-4666 will not harm the family. Family members will report hearing footsteps inside the dwelling during the night, with no signs of forced entry will be found. In the morning, children will discover presence at the foot of their beds. These will consist of toys crudely crafted from remains of human children. The criteria of any of which SCP-4666 determines the outcome of a West Knot events are unknown. Discovery SCP-4666 existence and ongoing activity were first detected in 1974 through the Foundation's newly implemented anomalous signature recognition system, with several, several high, highly for Similar home invasion incidents resulting in family deaths were found to be occurred throughout the northern hemisphere during the night of January 1st through the 2nd. Existent, 
extensive research into civilian and law enforcement archives worldwide eventually uncovered evidence of possible West Side events for nearly every preceding year going back to the late 18th century. Numerous historical documents are also found which appear to describe SCP-4666 activity occurring prior to this period, in some cases as early as the 2nd century AD in Europe and Russia, and as early as the 1st century in BC and Scandinavia. Fingerprints belonging to the same humanoid entity have been discovered at all locations of Foundation investigated but not events. These have been matched to the part Partial fingerprint found, preserved in dry blood on a recovered SP 4666 A instance dating from 1873. Fingerprints present, characteristics are not, now, not known to occur in human beings. Human like hairs are also recovered from locations of several West Knot events, though no DNA, human or, or otherwise, could be extracted from them. Right. Addendum 4666-01. On February 1st, 2018, several SCP-4666-A instances were discovered at a family residence in Huna, Alaska. Following the conclusion of West Side event number 060198, among these instances was SCP-4666-A-01. 0960, which consisted of a crude life size doll made from an emancipated body of a female child to which of the following modifications have been made. A dress made from various pieces of dirty, discolored clothing that have been sewn around the body in several places into the body skin. The mouth had been sewn shut with a thread made of from human tendons and the lips painted with Red with a solution consisting of primarily of human blood. The fingernails of, a, of another child have been glued over the body's fi uh, fingernails with pine risin. These have been painted red with the, with the same human body based solution. Three of the body's fingers were missing. The entire scalp had been removed from the head, and, a, and the scalp of another child with long blonde hair sewn into the head. In its place, the hair had been tied into two braids. Both eyes have been removed, and, and two large round pebbles on which eyes have been crudely painted placed into the empty orbits. Upon examination by the family and the child from whom the doll had been made, uh, made was found to be still alive, uh, albeit unconscious. Authorities have noted that and the child was airlifted to Barlett Regional Hospital in Juneau, Alaska, where she survived for 18 hours. Two Foundation agents were dispatched and were able to interview the subject. Following the subject's death, her, her body was confiscated by the agents and all witnesses and necessities per standard procedure. DNA testing revealed the subject from had been uh, I'm sorry, I'm going to butcher this name. Uh, Ekaterina uh, Morozova, age 7, of a known abduction victim of SCP-4666 taken from her family residence in Dubava, Russia, on February 1st, 2016. Uh, Autospy auto of the su subject Spotty showed that she'd been severely malnourished during the two years following her abduction, which had resulted in considerable stunting weight only 15 kilograms, height and only 90 uh, centimeters. A, a number of scars and burns were present on her skin, where, and she had suffered two bone fractures, left tib tibia and left ulna. Had not been reset and healed pro improperly. Hands had were heavily calloused. Cause of death was attributed to multiple organ failure, resulting from several sustained malnourishment. Footnotes: Analysis of recovered police photographs have shown that the size. Oh shit! Oh. Anyway, 
size, shape, and configuration of SCP-4666 teeth do not match those of a human being or any known animal. But to, also known as ASRP, the program marked the Foundation's first use of algorithms as a means of de detecting anom anomalous phenomena. Recordings of this interview have been currently being studied of the Department of Linguistics, as the language spoken by the subject was later found to match no known language, living or dead. Early indications are that it may be related to pre-Proto-Germanic. Now is it. That long art SCP thing was SCP-4666, a.k.a. the Yule Man. Oh. He was killed. Oh. Oh, shit. As soon as I turn around. So, what was everyone's thought on SCP-4666? And of course, I, I mean, I do appreciate that I died as pretty much when I stopped reading. I appreciate that. But I also didn't want to die. I wanted to live. Now, what I've have noticed, whenever I'm a D-class personnel, I always die immediately. So, eh. Um. <laughs> Poor Bright. <laughs> I mean, I mean, D-class are made to be killed technically through what I've re read a lot. Most D-class die, so yeah. Oh. Well then, <laughs> that D-class did not live long. Ah, yes, the darkness. Let it consume all forms of light. Let it consume everything. Wait, I just realized the person's name is literally just called someone. The person we're watching through right now is they're literally just called someone, which is perfect. Perfect the name. Oh, 
Oh, how dare you get back the darkness? The darkness must consume everything. How dare you? Yes. Go back into the darkness. Oh, I'm back. Time for murder. And I'm going the wrong way. Let's turn around. Time for to kill. There's nothing wrong with murder. Nothing wrong at all. What are you looking at? Stop looking at me. Totally did not waste any bullets because of that. Not at all. Well done. Oh, we're on lockdown. Well, this is completely accurate to what is going on with the world right now. We're in a freaking lockdown. What the fuck? It's closed, idiot. idiot. Oh, we're free. Yes, Corona's gone. All right. Let's see. Nope, stop. Freaking. Thank you. Oh. Shit. Well then. Fuck you, 096. Well, I guess I'll read SCP-323 and then probably play one more round in end stream. This will be the final SCP I read. Right. SCP-323, Object Class Euclid. Special Containment Procedures. SCP-323 is to be kept in a 17 meter by 17 meter by 17 meter concrete containment cell in Site-91. The object is to be restrained in the center of the cell within a 1 meter cube container of 8.8 centimeters thick, transparent armored lined with one way laminate, which is to be fit with one electric, oh, electronically locked access port. This container is to be internally lit with the surrounding cell kept dimmer to facilitate the one way laminate. The cell is to be surveyed remote, remotely at all times, and any signs of activity are to be reported. No personnel are to enter SCP-323's containment cell except, except to examine the integrity of SCP-323's restraint measures. The restraint measures are to be examined bi-weekly and any signs of damage are to be repaired immediately. All personnel who enter SCP-323's containment cell are to be uh, accompanied by an armed guard. Personnel are not to be within SCP-323's containment cell for longer than 45 minutes. And any communication around SCP-323 is to be written or spoken in a language other than English or French. In the event that SCP-323 bre breaches containment and an instance of SCP-323-1 is formed, personnel are to evacuate Site-91 and the site is to be locked down. Remote units are to be deployed to destroy the body of SCP-323-1. Following this, armed personnel may be sent to re-establish the containment of SCP-323. Description. SCP-323 is a skull of an unidentified uh, cervid measuring 55 centimeters long and 27 centimeters wide and 31 centimeters tall with a pair of, of antlers measuring uh, 35 centimeters tall and 46 centimeters from tip to tip, 
growing from the left and right sides of SCP-323. SCP-323 shows signs of damage consistent with outside exposure, with regular pitting, scarring, and weathering across the, across the object. Leaching on the upper surfaces and missing lower mandible and rear of the skull features an approximate a centered ovid gap, measuring 25 centimeters high and 23 centimeters wide, giving access to the interior space of 16 centimeters deep. This gap shows signs of tool use, indicating that it was carved with tools, possibly stone. SCP-323 displays the ability to react to aureal, tactile, and visual stimuli. Testing has revealed that SCP-323 appears to have a field of view similar to that of other cervids, and has responded to visual stimuli from up to 50 meters away. The targeting of specific members of personnel, various attempts to breach containment, and violent reaction towards speakers of French and English language, languages suggest a level of sapience. However, this is unconfirmed. SCP-323 is capable of limiting limited locomotion, typically in the form of small movements and vibrations. In most cases, SCP-323 will only locomote in the event of various stimuli, such as moving away when touched or turning when the personnel are present within its containment chamber. SCP-323 has demonstrated the ability to to make larger movements, such as lunging at, at personnel or repeated attempting to force its way through the containment procedures. SCP-323 has an influential effect. Fuck her stairs. Okay, there we go. Uh, uh, mm, I think I lost this. What the fuck? Trust you. Need some. Gosh damn it. I have something caught on my headset. It's making static sounds. Stop it. For fuck's sake, stop it. I'm trying to read. Okay. That's it. Fucking hell. Thank you. Enough of the damn static. Anyway, SCP-323... What? What? Excuse me? Fuck you, asshole. I'll try that again. Piece of shit. Anyway, SCP-323 exerts an influential effect in a radius extending roughly 15 meters from itself. Individuals within this radius have, will begin exper experiencing cannibalistic thoughts and urges, violent outbursts, and impaired judgment after approximately one hour of continuous exposure. Roughly 74% of individuals who reach this point will attempt to place their heads through the gap between and the back of SCP-323 with efforts made to keep their mouths uncovered. If an individual is capable of fitting their heads through through the gap, attempts will be made to bludgeon their heads against nearby hard surfaces until the point the individual head, individual's head fits, the individual loses consciousness, or the individual expires. Once the individual has fit their head through SCP-323, the individual will be classified as SCP-323-1. Oh, great. Oh, I'm dead, anyway. All right. Uh, S within 10 minutes of putting SCP-323 on, SCP-323-1 will undergo drastic physical alterations. Holy shit. Oh, shit. What did I say? I instantly die every single fucking time. Every time. Anyway. SCP, uh, SCP 
323-1 will experience a rapid loss of body fat, body hair, and pigmentation, followed by the rupturing of their distal uh, phalanges from their fingertips, and a normal tooth growth and blackening of extremities consistent with frostbite. Additionally, with SV323-1 appears to experience greater strength and pain tolerance than average human. However, SV323-1 still appears to be sustainable to physical harm as it were prior to his introduction of SCP-323. SCP-323's metabolism will experience a dramatic increase, requiring a constant caloric intake with starvation occurring anywhere between 15 to 30 minutes if no self-preservation efforts are made. In order to sustain this increased metabolism, SCP-323-1 will actively seek out and eat other individuals uh, got other individuals or substance until expiration. In the event SCP-323-1 is incapable of finding plentiful nourishment, SCP-323-1 will make efforts to sustain itself, including limited movement, rationing available food, and auto-cannibalism. SCP-323-1 will only feed upon humans. It is presumed that SCP-323-1 is capable of receiving substance from other sources, but chooses not to, despite availability or ease of access. During the pursuit of individuals, SCP-323-1 has been known to occasionally make various statements on the Severn Ojibwe, but Patawatamani, and Cree languages, as well as its native language, of this the instance, it is known, it is not known if these statements had the knowledge of these languages is the result of SCP 323's anomalous influence or they originate from SCP 323 itself. SCP 323 was recovered in in September 12, 1997, in the Bittern Lake Reserve, part of the Lac La Rouge First Nation in Saskatchewan, Canada. Redacted, a small registered community had been sustaining a, an active SCP-323-1 instance by routinely murdering individuals and leaving them out as an appeasement. Investigation revealed redacted individuals were involved who interviewed and subsequently administered amnestics, and a cover story involving an unidentified serial killer who propagated, who was, was propagated. SV-323-1, at the, at the time suspected to be an anomaly, died of starvation during its transfer to Site-91. The record number of deaths does not appear consistent with the duration of SCP-323-1 instance. It is suspected that SCP-323-1 uh, went through several instances. Oh no! It is suspected that SCP-323 went through several instances of SCP-323-1 before containment. However, no irrefutable evidence supporting SCP-323-1's longevity have been uncovered. Interview SCP-323-A, James Namagus, an, an individual involved in the murders of sustaining of SCP-323-1's prior to its containment, was brought in for questioning involving SCP-323-1. Mr. Namagus remained unusually calm throughout and after the interview. Following the interview and containment of SCP-323, Mr. Namagus was administered amnestics and was reintroduced to his community. Doctor Redacted. I'm just going to say doctor for now on. Doctor, please state your name for the record. Uh, James Namagus. Doctor, please state your involvement with murders. Namagus, I helped move the bodies for a one to go to eat. Doctor, what do you know about the object? Malagos, there is a story of Cree men back when fighting was common who tried to control a Wendigo to give his people an advantage. It was just a story the elders knew more, but we were safe, so we didn't ask. Doctor, when did you first encounter an Indian entity? Uh, Malagos, one night I heard yelling all around the village. A warped man 
walked out of the woods, killed our friends right in front of us. Sometimes it would stare more than it would just, it would want to make to kill. Trying to talk to you, it whispered to me, Ping Misto, come and eat. It made me cold in my bones. Uh, doctor, and then, no, just, then I felt I could understand the warped man, the one to go, and that we could leave with him like we all do when we pass. When I was made to kill, I thought to this, and it calmed me. I didn't run. Mr. Namagoose closes his eyes and exhales slowly after a minute. He resumes talking. It would look at me at me sometimes. I could hear him in my mind. I could feel him watching me from out of my own eyes. This helped me watch these people die, and I hoped it would pass on my family. Doctor. Thank you, Mr. Namagoose. Final note. No mental effects similar to what Mr. Namagoose stated have yet to be reported uh, uh, to by staff who have interacted with SCP-323 or SCP-323-1. Further investigation to this has not been planned. However, staff in, ha, are encouraged to report any uh, a typical thoughts of feelings or experience while working with either. And that was SCP-323. And the final SCP that I'll be reading. Also, the other name it goes by is the Wendigo Skull. All right, what do I get to be this time? Please don't be D-class. Please don't be D-class. Please don't be D-class. Please. Please. What the frick? What the frick? Oh, that's why. Okay. All right. Watch. And I'm probably going to die immediately. Oh, can't go that way. Um, but uh, what was everyone's thoughts on SCP-323? <laughs> well, that was fast. Bam! It spawned right at it. And obviously, no one here. Yeah, I want to get out of here before I die. Let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in. Let me in. Oh, no, 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 no. I found the other and Are you serious? And I get yay. <laughs> I know. Oh, oh. Present, present, present. Damn fuckers took all the presents. Motherfucker. Greedy assholes. Oh, I don't like how it's dark. Gosh dang it, can I stop finding the exits? I need a key card first. It's the, literally the tree stuck in the wall. The tree is literally stuck in the wall. <laughs> the tree is... Oh wait, that's not tree, that's lazel. Wait, never mind, ignore what I said. That, that wasn't a tree. It was, um... Decorations, ignore what I said. I didn't say anything. I forgot to spawn. 
ignore what I say. Uh, that was just my stupid moment. And why is there are no lights? Why is the lights off? This is back there. Why? Uh, where's SCP 914? No. I'm going to go through here, maybe. Crap. Yeah, let's go here. Oh, let's go here. Yes. No. <laughs> Damn it. I have no idea where I'm going. I am just surprised that I've lived this long. Hmm, I wonder if it's keep up. Hi! I don't know what I got. I got adrenaline, janitor key card. Fuck. As soon as I get presents, I die. Damn it. I am upset. The, the tree has it out for me. They want me dead. <laughs> tree hates me. It was a trap. <laughs> Never trust that, the tree SCP. Never trust them. And I'm in here. Let's let's bombard. Let's attack. Let's kill. Murder. All right. Uh, housekeeping. Uh, housekeeping. It's okay. You can come out. We're just housekeeping. Don't worry about the giant blood-covered dog. It's fine. No, it's not. Oh, gate B. Fuck. Where are people? I want to murder all. Oh. Okay, who's shooting me? I don't know. Attack! Attack! Aww. Oh. Damn it.
Yeah, once this is round's over, I'm gonna head off from streaming and then restream later. So I can finish Bioshock like I was supposed to yesterday. Well, I'm like two days ago. But streaming service is good. Yeah. There's more SCPs than there are. Oh. Yeah, I think they just died. No, but I do plan on to. I do plan to. Not, I'm not sure if I schedule that for this week. I might have. If not, I'll do more next week. Hmm. Yeah, seeing the ratio, I think SCPs are going to win. Since there's only two people who are not SCPs alive. <laughs> uh, I can double check, make sure. So, and I know I have to beat it. But um, I have to check my schedule. I didn't schedule for this one. I think I no, I did not. <sighs> of course, one thing I was supposed to, d to finish, I forgot. Well, I know what I'm going to be doing next week. <laughs> <laughs> It's not on this week, so something. Uh, yeah. Yep, that'll be what I'll be doing most of next week. Is well, technically, I only need one stream to finish it. It's like one day next week. I'll do Fran. This is so entertaining watching two people do shit. Oh. Well, I mean, you left it open, but the SCPs can't open that door. So, why did you leave it open? That was stupid. Yes, yeah, so a surgery agent. I just want to see who wins. I, I think SAPs will win. I think they still will win, not the chaos and surgery surgency. Come on, SAPs. I believe in you. Murder them. Murder. Oh, yes, yes, bring on the murder, bring on the murder, bring it on, kill him, kill him, kill him.
Oh, they killed an SCP. That's bullshit. Yes, <laughs> murder them. No, stop losing. Yes, murder them. Duggo, no. Duggo, why? Why are you? Why aren't you murdering them, Doggo? We have to murder them, Doggo. No! Damn it! Well, it's time for me to win, technically. We already know where they are at. Wait, what? Oh, shit. <laughs> I know that didn't help, but it blinded my teammates. Shoot the door. Well, I can't turn it off. We're fucked. So, yeah, we got about 10 seconds till we die. Yay. Goodbye, everyone. Um, oh, I thought that would kill me. I'm, I'm alive. Oh, damn. Yay! Alright. Disconnect. Yes. Yes! Let me late. Thank you. Alright. Um, if you have any last words to say before I end stream, I uh, go ahead and say them now. All right. All right. Hope you enjoyed my SV readings, and I'll see you D class next time.